dawn of the new millennium, Pope John Paul II challenged the church to launch out into the deep and to engage in a new missionary endeavour. Net Ministries is a practical response to this call, taking the message of the gospel and making it relevant to the lives of young people. NET is a peer-to-peer -peer Catholic youth ministry and that excites me because it's young people being positive role models to other young people. They themselves face the challenges of this generation and they are able to provide positive, long-term alternative solutions to those challenges. When we began in 1988, we had one team of 12 volunteers and they reached around about 2,000 lives. Now we have six teams of 40 volunteers per year and they reach about 30,000 lives. That's meant that over the 20 years that we've been operating, we've been able to impact on the lives of over a half a million young people. NET has two models of ministry in Australia. The national team travels to schools and parishes around the country running retreats for all year levels. NET has a number of local teams that are based in one parish or diocese. These teams establish youth groups, run youth masses and work in local schools to encourage and challenge the faith of young people. NET has been invited beyond our borders to countries such as Singapore, Malaysia, Papua New Guinea, New Zealand, the Marshall Islands and Uganda. In Uganda, NET has sent teams to provide leadership training and carry out youth ministry. This has been supported with the implementation of local community development projects. I think NET is so good simply because it's it's peer-to-peer -peer ministry. It's a young person talking to a young person and um, sharing a faith that is alive and relevant um, in today's society. It's something young people don't see very often. We get to hang and chill with the the kids on retreats, and uh, like half of them are still my age. You know, like, and it's it's just really good for them to see us, um, to be able to have a faith and it still be cool. You know, like, it's it's not something that. It's, for, it's not for old people, you know, like faith is for us as youth and, uh, you know, and they're able to see that through us. Uh, the changes I've seen in young people has been absolutely huge. There's no other way of explaining it. Uh, that's probably... Being on retreats, I was on a travelling team and uh, when I was travelling around we, we sort of, um, you, do, you do retreats and you go from school to school and place to place every single day and when I was on there you'd get to turn up to a, a retreat site and you'd have your retreatants there and they'd look at you as you walk in and they'd just look at you as if you were an alien or, oh great, what are these clowns going to do today? And uh, they'd come on retreat and First, first thing we'd do would be lively in action and they'd be like, you could see it in their, in their eyes, they were confused as this isn't what I pictured for today. Um, well, for me it was exciting. I, I learned like, different things about God and how he can teach you and that he always loves you. And it was really good and all the activities they did was really exciting and fun. Uh, the net team came along and they played some games with us which were really fun and did some skits and dramas. and. Uh, one talk that they did was really impacting on me and my mates and gave us some things that we really need to think about. 
Our school community at Mount Murray College Petrie have had the great privilege of being able to work with the netters over the past four years. The young people at NET seem to be able to connect with our youth no matter what their background is. This is largely due to their rich repertoire of skills, which they're able to draw on on many occasions. Their ability to communicate in their original and colourful style enables the message to be transmitted easily and with comfort. I think NET is a great vehicle for us. NET's worked really well with us as a school. It's young people coming to share their faith, their experience of God. We found that it engages our young people and adds to a suite of things of retreat programs and service and outreach. And NET is a really vital part of that, of speaking to our young people, having them share their faith journey with others. Uh, it's great. The experience of NET at this college has really been vital and essential to our religious education program. Hello, I'm Father Don Murphy. I first came across NET in 1996 when a group of NETers stayed at our, our priory. Um, I'm a Dominican priest. I was a student with the order then and I was so impressed and encouraged by these young people who were just marvellously alive in their faith and we had many great chats about the. As a result of that, when I was a deacon in 1998, I was on a NET team for six months and that was a key, uh, a key experience in my whole priestly life as it's turned out. I, uh, I think I got a, a, a hopefulness and a, uh, what could be done with young people through my work with the NET team and that great enthusiasm and the joy that they bring, the joy of their faith. I think it's very easy to go down the wrong path at their age. Uh, just like we've been there, we've done that, you know, like uh, a lot of the time and uh, to be able to say, yeah, we, we were in these places, you know, um, we don't know exactly what they're going through, but they can relate something in their life that they're going through to something that we have gone through in the past. I have a, I have a real passion for youth and working with young people. Um, I've seen a lot of young people go down the wrong path and just haven't, feel like they have no hope. And so I just really felt God calling me to be in that life and be in that position to be able to help them.